so OCD. I can't even... Well, I have to have some order, don't you think? I suppose so. Or we're going to repeat ourselves. We've already done like a hundred of them. I, no, we haven't. Thirteen videos is all okay. we have. Oh, yes! Okay, so we've been on again, so I did it to you again. Again? Yeah. That's my call to, to action, is putting it on before you even know. I didn't even do my list yet. I know, but... Well, do your Roseanne thing. You want to talk about Roseanne, let's do that, and then we'll do the other one next. Mm, I don't want to talk about it, I decided. You don't want to? No, I, you know, I feel bad for her, and I feel bad for her cast, but, you know, you can't put yourself in the spotlight, and... This is what you chose to do, Roseanne Barr. You decided you wanted to be a comedian on TV with the Disney Channel. Well, you can't attack people. No. I know comedians do that all the time. I was talking to you about Richard Pryor. Yeah, but Pryor she attacked kind of like, she attacked race. She did. You can attack maybe a person's name and a person, but not race. It's funny, we have like, I would expect you to be saying what I'm saying and me to be saying what you're saying. Mm -hmm. Not funny. That is funny. But I, in real reality, she was wrong to say mm -hmm. those things. It was mean. It was cruel. And all you need to do is have a little kindness in your heart. Be humble and kind, as Tim McGraw says. Mm -hmm. And you know, you can be funny without being mean. But some people are mean, and they're very funny, like Richard Pryor. And if you didn't like what v, v Valerie stood for, then talk about what you didn't like about what she stood for. Don't call names. Right. Names. Right. Name calling. Stop. But I still feel bad for her. I really, really, really do. Because, well, you know, she got away, has gotten away with this for years. She has issues. And now she's ruined a, a bunch of people's lives mm -hmm. by, by um, just continuing with what she's been getting away with. Mm -hmm. I really feel bad for her, too. I mean, if she was on a cable channel... And doing I don't know. raw stand-up comedy. I don't know. You can't that. say that, though. You can't say that. Because remember Kramer back in the day said something? Oh, yes, remember he did. That? He I got in trouble. What he said. Yeah. I think it was towards Jewish people or something. The N-word. Oh, yeah. Oh, he used he said, the N-word. Yeah. yeah, he got in trouble on he that. He got in big trouble for yep. that. So you cannot... You can't attack people. Attack people for their race, creed, color, religion... Leave all that out. Do just make fun of their hair. If you, if you make yeah, if you make a bad decision about the Iran deal or something like that, make fun of that or I don't know. Yeah. Well, I still feel bad and I, I and I love the show because of the controversy and because we're of they they sh they're showing the both sides of the the platform and meeting in the middle. I loved it. I thought it was great. Yeah. So sorry about pisses that. me off. Lori Metcalf. Ugh. Sorry, I hope you find some more work. All right, so now yeah, well. we're, we're going to move into... Um, Why don't you fill in? You could be Roseanne. They call her Rhonda. <laughs> I'm trying to laugh like that. Right? <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> uh, yeah. Can I am a little dry. I could probably do that. Oh, right, Dan. Mm -hmm. Dan, are you awake, Dan? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to talk about um, being young and we're, oh, smooth transition. Really? Oh, no, we're going to take a break, but we're going to go into the next one, which will be... Go ahead. Wait, oh, we're not going to continue on with this? Oh, I got to pee. <laughs> I need a break. I am not... We've and been I haven't doing done my this list. for three I minutes. I haven't done my list yet. All right. Bye. Bye. All right, hold on. People, don't start yet. Oh, okay, good, because we did. <laughs> I, got, I got Mimi this time. <laughs> okay, so now let's talk about the old bars we used to go to and dance. Okay, I'll, I'll, I know the first one, I came down on spring break. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 1902. What year? <laughs> 1983. 83. No, um, no, no, no. 82. 82. Mm -hmm. And um, I knew one person down here. Yeah. She was older than me, so I came down, blah, blah, blah. And we went to a bar called Port-au-Prince. 
Oh, yeah. All the... Who remembers Port-au-Prince? All right, thumbs up for that. It was two levels. It was on 50 next to... Um, like the where? big car dealership. Pontiac. It was Pontiac. Yeah, yeah it was Pontiac. Pontiac. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Now it's like Ultimate Cars or something. It's still there, but not the Port of Prince. No, I don't even think the, the building's there anymore. Well, That bar was awesome. When you first came down here. But I like the fact, the first bar you ever went to up north, because I thought it was very cleverly, cleverly named. Oh. Because, like, you know, we were very closeted. And art growing up. Oh, yeah, you had a 80s high. and you, 90s. You couldn't. You walked in like this. Oh, my God. You were so embarrassed of who you might see. Not embarrassed. You're just going to die and your parents are going to find out or something. Yeah, something like that. But the name of the bar where Ann used to go was called Somewhere. So you'd see people like us and you'd go, Have I seen you somewhere before? And then you go, Well, yeah. Oh, that was very clever. That was good. Right? It's still there, I think. Is it? I think it's still there. I, I had Franklin Street and brought it. It took me months, I remember. It was very fun. Very fun. But the first bar I ever went to here was and it, it is still here, Southern Nights. Southern Nights. Southern Nights. I went to Southern Nights. I saw Oh, them. there was plenty of fun nights there. Plenty. Plenty. Plenty when they had the Lesbo a go go. Oh. Oh my god. D H. Oh, she's hot. She's still and hot. F, I know. F mm. Frank. Frankie and Denise. Uh huh. I used to put a dollar in her shoe every time. I, Denise Harrison. I tried to look down her pants. I'm Stop like, it! I didn't really. Stop I didn't it! Pulled it out. Um, and that, so that was the first bar I ever went to. But then I thought you were at a bar getting a drink from Lee. Many, 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 many other many. bars. So we had, um, well, Odds and Ends was actually what Faces was called before uh, it changed to Faces. Yes. The odds and ends. So this was like, see, that's how society viewed us as the odds and ends of society. And we came together as one there and on Edgewater Drive. we were a drive. face. We were a face. And then I went to faces. And here's our face. And we're going to mm-hmm. stand up and be proud. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dang it. And well, Parliament House. Oh, that's still here. The drag show. Yeah, that was fun. That's Miss P. Oh, my gosh. Did you laugh? And you were always so scared that if she picked you out of the crowd, you would die. Oh, yeah. Because she picked someone out of the crowd to tease all the time. Plus, you're not supposed to be there, remember? Right. Oh, yeah. Uh, And the drinking age was only 18 when I was growing up, so I could drink from the time I wanted to, but I didn't. Nickel, nickel, what was that? Wild Wednesdays, and they had nickel beer at... at, Oh, my God. uh, Um, at, um, no, Southern no, Nights. Southern Nights. But you don't have any idea what you were drinking. Because it was not beer. I didn't I, I, it was beer. I did liquor. I oh, think. 7 and 7 was hot. I didn't drink that. I did. I great drink scotch. Tom oh. Collins. I'd never taste one again. Never, ever again. Why do they put those cherries in it? Ugh. <laughs> what was the place on 50 that, um, that um, Kathy... Uh, oh, where the Lombardies used to be. Lombardi's was there? Yeah, there was a Lombardi seafood restaurant. Okay, let's call Kathy and Wait, ask wait, her. let me think. I can remember. Hold on. Um, no, you're not going to remember. Yeah, it's like the Royale now. It's um, like it turned into a strip club. I'm um, calling her. All right, call Kathy. Without the boxes. Put, put you just right here. Hey. Could you yeah. read it? It's, it's Ann and Mimi, and you're live on our yeah. Lagby Eye channel right now. Oh, no. That's not really live. Why'd you tell her? You're such a Oh, parent. I forgot. You're well, live at work with Jayla Z and Miss Petey. Oh, hi, hi. Miss Petey. Oh, you are at work? Yeah. Okay, quick question. Remember the bar oh. that used to be Lombardi's? Where, What's where, that part again? The, yes. the, the, bar, the bar we used to go to yes. in the LJ. Yes, I had trouble at. Huh? What? The one I, I had, I ran away from. Yes, what yeah, was the name of it? Twins. Yes. <laughs> you, you went underneath the pool table? Yeah, I went under the pool table and ran out the door. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. what's the name? What's the name of it? It is, hold on. Come on. Uh, uh, hold on. Uh, not cul- cul- culture, was it? Culture Club! Oh. Culture Club! Not to vote for ya! Okay, thank you. Go back to work teaching the chillins. All right, all right. Bye-bye. Love you. Love you. <laughs> Culture Club. I'll tell them both for you. Thank you, Thanks, Kathy. Kathy. You got it. Oh, my you gosh. Her. She was in class. She was in class teaching. Miss Miss Petey, they call her. Yeah. That's so cute. 
She took the time. Thank you very much for coming up with that. That's the Culture Club. Down, 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 down. She got, she got, remember, she got, we didn't even tell us. Yeah, she got in trouble. She had to run out of there. Uh, Miss Petey did. Miss <laughs> Petey got in trouble there. Then we had Sadie. Oh, props to Judy Shaw. She owned that. Judy Shaw did? Yes. I didn't know Judy Shaw. I forgot that. Yep. Shit, Shit. I'm getting old. Yeah, uh, it was she. It was funny because it was very controversial. It was? Yeah, uh, apparently she only let people in she liked. Oh. And if she didn't like it, you had to go. Well, that's the rule. I know. Her. I know it. So. I never got There's a black bean deli there or something now. Really? Yeah. Oh. Every time I drive by, I think of it. Um, Peacock room? Peacock, cock, cock. That's still here, isn't it? I don't know. Speaking of uh, PD, how about the Lava Lounge? Lava Lounge. Lava Lounge. That was fun. That was a good place to go. Hang out. Who's the Lava Lounge? Oh, yeah. That was right next to Peacock. Peacock, and then it moved over to where um, oh, right, Hammer right, Lamb right. is now. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. So the, Pe uh, the Lava Lounge was Oh, fun. Phoenix. Remember that? That was in Summer County oh, for a Lord. hot second. Phoenix, the Phoenix. Well, I used to go there and learn line dancing during the week on Thursdays. Oh, did you? I learned the Wild Wild West. What was that other bar that did that when I lived on Walton Road? I don't know. Off of Rose. Oh, when you and Christy used to go. Yeah, well, Christy and Heidi That was used it, to go. the Phoenix. You used to go there on Thursdays. No, 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 the other one, the two-story with the pool outside. Off oh, of yeah, Rose Key Avenue. Largo. Key Largo. I didn't, oh, I do have it. I just didn't say it. Yeah, Key Largo. Key that was the biggest best bar in all the whole wide world. The biggest best? Oh my gosh! They're three, four levels in a pool. Oh, Frankie used to come with Jerome. Remember Jerome? I and do. And do their thing. Mm -hmm. When I die and they lay me to rest, I'm gonna go to the place that's best. When I die, la la la. Go. I Going on I, up I to the you, spirit that, in the sky. I want that plate at my funeral. I know. So why are you making fun? I'm not. I couldn't remember the words. <sighs> spirit in the sky. Yep. They would do anyway, that. Anyway, hopefully that brought some uh, memories back to people that live in Orlando. Yeah. Oh. Or Tampa. Is, okay. So um, speaking of all those bars, um, the old odds and ends and the old faces and um, the one we just said, the Key Largo. I worked with this lady. Jeannie. I know you all know her, Jeannie Ch Chestnut. I wish I knew where she was. I don't know what happened to her. Uh, I think she lives in Canada. She's still there. But I have to tell you, I have such fond memories of her. She was so sweet to me. She always did the nicest things for me. Like, I was poor. I worked with her mowing lawns. You were the deal. Didn't she call you that? Yeah, she called me the deal, which was sweet. I always felt very, very special. Ronnie, you always used to get, you always got into faces for free, too. You never had to pay the cover. You remember that? Mm -mm. You'd go in. She'd like pull you in, and then I had to pay, but you didn't. Oh, well, you know. They let those good looking ones in. Those I don't know what was that. Pull up to my bumper. Anyway, so this genie, she had a knife that. Now, I was not. I, I was making probably, I don't even think, $5 an hour back then. You had to have. And working my. Yeah, my ass off. You had to make five. Okay, maybe five dollars an hour. But and she worked with me, and we sat in the back of this truck of a lawn maintenance crew all summer long for two summers, I think. And sometimes I just didn't have money for, to eat, and she would always share her sandwich with me. Well, she had this knife that she used for everything. She'd get it out. She would she would pick her teeth with it. <laughs> she'd clean her toenails with it, and then she'd cut her sandwich in half <laughs> and give me one half. If you know me you at all, it? yes, I was starving. Oh my if god! If you know me at all, you know I had to just go within and think. You know, it's uh, it's my genie. Was it peanut butter and jelly? No, she'd like buy a hoagie or something. Oh, at the store? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh gosh, she was a sweet girl. She changed my oil for free. Now I had no money at all, but I had a three hundred ZX. I paid the car payment. Yeah. That's well, why you well, you had, had money. You had that have car money. because I paid the car payment. <laughs> you are full. Of, okay, maybe. Anyway, if anyone knows where Jeannie is, I'd love to know. I'd love to know if she's well or what. Because I really, she made a difference in my life. Sweet lady. Sweet, sweet lady. She was. Yeah. She mm -hmm. was. No, that's it. All right, well. That's it for the bar talk. Just bow, reminiscing. Bow, 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 we didn't really want to reminisce what happened at each, um, at each place. Is it? It's background music. <laughs> Never mind. There's a story at every bar. So. I'm a man.
without conviction. I don't know. Okay. Love you all, and we'll see you later. Dears.